Get ready to have a wild conversation with your documents. It's time to make those PDFs, docs, and TXT files spill the beans like gossiping besties. This video is about DocuJet, or you can also call it Document Chat, powered by GPT-3. DocuJet offers you the ability to create your own chatbot or personal assistant. With DocuJet, you can upload your documents, books, notes, and even that embarrassing contracts, and ask the quirkiest questions you think of. Imagine having a chatbot that can answer all your employees' questions about company policies, procedures, and best practices. And if you are a teacher, you can make learning more convenient and engaging by uploading how-to resources, course materials, and notes. With DocuChat, you can create your very own public or private chatbot, and you can also share it with your friends. It's like having your personal genie in a bottle. Except this genie can quickly and effortlessly fetch accurate answers from vast bodies of text. Say goodbye to endless searching and hello to instant enlightenment. Are you ready to unleash the power of your personal genie? Get ready to witness the magic as we bring your genie out of the bottle into the world of DocuChat. All right, let's break it down step by step. Open up your browser and head to docuchat.io. Now, once you have reached this page, click on Get Started. This will take you to the registration page. To proceed, register with your Gmail account and create your desired password. And click on Sign In. Afterward, you will land on docuchat dashboard page. On the dashboard, you will discover three options: Chat, Create, and Settings. Within this chat section, you have complete control over your created chatbot. From here, you can manage every aspect of your chatbot, including changing their name, modifying descriptions, and updating data set to keep them up to date. Highly effective. Now, from this small round arrow icon, you can change your avatar and change your profile picture from this option. And you can also see here a uh, recycle bin, something like recycle bin icon. If you click on it, then you can also delete this chatbot. And from this uh, share icon, you can share with your friend. Now, if you click on it, it will copy the link. So let's try and open in private. Paste that copy copied link. Like this, you can share your chatbot to anyone, like your friends or anyone. So now they can chat with your chatbot. Now let's ask something to this chatbot about hacking. As we train this chatbot as an ethical hacker, this chatbot will only give us answers which is related to ethical hacking. This is how your chatbot will work. Get ready to discover an array of chatbots created by experts in various fields. These brilliant minds have generously shared their valuable insights. Explore the wide range of chatbots and unlock a world of valuable information and experiences. Additionally, we can engage in interactive conversation with these chatbots. For example, someone has created SEO expert chatbot. We can have a direct conversation and ask specific questions to gain insights and advice. So let's ask some questions to this SEO expert chatbot. Now let's see how to create our own chatbot like this. Now let's create your very own chatbot. To create your own chatbot, click on create. In the name section, choose a name that reflects your chatbot's identity. Now in description, describe expertise of your chatbot. Now moving on the document section. Now remember one thing, DocuChat only supports PDF, docs and text file as a dataset file. Now this is our dataset file which we are going to import in this document section. Now remember your chatbot will respond on information you provided in this dataset file. Now, how to create your dataset file? It's very simple. One, go to your desktop and take a document, text document. You can also take Word file or PDF something. But I'm going to take this document, and this is all our questions and their answers. I'm going to copy this and and I'm going to paste in this new dataset file and now save it. Now our chatbot is ready to publish and remember one thing, it will only respond according to our dataset file. Whatever information we provide in our dataset file, it will answer accordingly. And let's click on create. And now our chatbot is created and let's ask some question. Like we just copied our question and ask it. Now our chatbot is replying according to our dataset. Now you can see reply is same as it is in our dataset file. 
This is how you can create your own chatbots and share with your friends. And now we have left this settings section. Let's take a look. From here, from settings section, you can conveniently monitor your plan details, including your current free plan and options to upgrade other available plans. If you found this video helpful, make sure to like this video and subscribe our channel. Your support is greatly appreciated. Thank you for watching.